So Ram is king of the heap. Number one in this year's J.D. Power & Associates initial quality awards. We talked to Mark Chapman from Stellantis, who is Ram's parent company, and they say they are very happy with many of their brand's performance in this year's awards. To have three of our brands, Ram, Dodge, and Jeep, all in the top quartile, uh, it's a great day for Stellantis. It is a first time win for Ram, followed closely by their sister brand Dodge, who came in second. Luxury brand and ranked third overall is actually the Japanese automotive brand Lexus. They are consistently at the top for initial quality and also reliability as well. Now it was interesting to see Mitsubishi jump to the number four spot in this year's survey, which measures the number of problems that consumers have with their vehicles over the first 90 days of ownership. So then who is in last place and dropped the most? It's actually Chrysler. They're sitting at the very bottom. But surprisingly, right above them is German automotive maker Audi. Now the survey shows that Tesla are third from the bottom in this year's survey, but they're not officially part of the survey because J.D. Power & Associates don't have permission to survey owners needed in certain states. So there's good news and there's bad news. In 2020, general new vehicle improvement is up about 2%, which is good. But if you compare it against the last decade, they're actually down about 3% in improvement. What well, was the biggest complaint by consumers this year? Smartphones with an increase in wireless technology. Smartphones and wireless technology are making consumers confused and unhappy. That's Mike Goodell, and I'm Nick Miles.